Hi guys, here's my Pocahontas Halloween costume makeup, so if you guys want to learn how I got this look, just keep watching. So first I'm going to grab my NYX HD primer base and apply that all over my face. For my foundation, I'm using my YSL Fusion Ink Foundation in B40 Sand and applying that all over my face. prep my eyes, I'm using MAC Pro Longwear Concealer in NC20 and I'm applying that on my eyelids. Next, I'm going to be doing my usual eyebrow routine. So if you haven't seen it yet, you can check out my eyebrow tutorial that I will link down below in the information box. And this is just how I do it. So next I'm going to be using the Smashbox lipstick in the color Infrared and applying that with a shader brush from Hair and Makeup Addiction and you can just disregard the line that's in between my eyebrows because I thought that I was going to be doing a mask just underneath my eyebrows but then I decided to blend that line upwards and make a bigger mask. Honestly guys, I was just making this look up as I went so um, you guys can do whatever you guys want with this look. Uh, here's my take on it. set the lipstick on my face, I'm going to be using these two color eyeshadows to give it a little bit more color and to set it so that the lipstick doesn't rub off easily. And here I'm using the C433 Pro Blending Fluff Brush by Crown Brushes. So I thought my eyes needed a little bit something more so I'm going to be using my MAC Chroma Line in Black Black and making um, my eyeliner but as you guys can see later it's not going to be perfect I'm going to be blending that out with some eyeshadow. And this is my favorite eyeliner brush which is the IB113 Taclon Angle Liner by Crown Brushes. So here you're going to see me start to blend out my eyeliner with the same eyeshadow that I used to set my lipstick base, but then I'm going to be taking this darker shade from the Morphe 35N Matte Palette and I'm going to start blending that out as well. To complete my eyes, I'm going to be applying loads of mascara on my eyes and then I'm going to be applying my eyelashes. For my lips, I thought I would do a cool pattern so I took the same lipstick I used on my eyeshadow base and applied that right in the center of my lips and used an, a red eye pencil to just create the outline of it and fill it in. The brush I'm using is a BK44 Pointed Lip by Crown Brushes as well. To help my eyes pop a little bit more, I'm using this NYX Eye Pencil 
and milk and I'm going to be putting that along my waterline. Next I'm taking my Wet n Wild white eyeliner pencil and I'm going to be continuing the pattern down my chin in this V shape. I kind of made it a little wider as I went along because it was getting hard for me to make a V shape for some reason. But then you'll see that I took um, some concealer on a brush and I started to make it into a V. Taking that same pencil, I made these little dots along my cheekbone just to add a little bit more design to the costume. Then I decided I wanted a little bit more white at the top of my face, so I decided to make this white line above the red. And I thought my lips were looking a little bare, so I'm using this lip pencil by Nabi in Coffee and my NYX Matte Lipstick in Sable, and I'm going to be applying that around the red on my lips. When I finished recording this whole video, I just remembered that I forgot to do um, some contouring and some bronzing on my cheeks, so if you guys want to do that, please go ahead and do that too. To finish off the look, I have this headband that my friends and I made for Coachella last year, and it's, it's nice because it looks a little bit of tribal, and it has these feathers that we made. Um, from Michaels, like some plies from Michaels. So you can get all these from Michaels and just add some beads and feathers to it and there you go. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you guys liked it, please like and subscribe to my channel and let me know what you guys think. See you later!